I wanted to wish you a Merry Christmas and tell you that you're loved. Thank you very much, and I hope you, everything goes all right for you. It's gone well. It's gone well. It's been going well for me ever since I met you. And uh, Bird and I were just thinking about what wonderful people uh, uh, you and uh, Miss Bess have been to us since uh, uh, we uh, uh, met you, and we wanted to thank you. Appreciate that very much, and I want to tell you that I enjoyed the book you sent me. Oh, well, bless your heart. Well, and you... Nothing in any person you've ever done. Well, you, you, you are always in our hearts. And there's, there's Miss Truman, and I wish you could see this pretty portrait of hers hanging, hanging here in the White House. We take so much pride in pointing out to all of our uh, guests uh, uh, this portrait because we think she's a very unusual lady. Well, I think that's very true, and I'm agreeing with you. <laughs> <laughs> and, oh, Mr. President, I hope you just had a happy, happy time. Did you have your grandchildren with you? Okay. Uh, this is Lady Bird. I hope you had a happy Christmas. And did you have your grandchildren with you? No. No, they couldn't come out this time. Well, I know you had a good visit with them in the summer, though. Is that pardon? I, I know you had a good visit with, with them sometime in the, in the summer, because I remember seeing some pictures, and you looked so happy. That's right. That's mighty nice. Well, will you give Mrs. Freeman uh, my love, and uh, we, we just wanted to wish you both a happy Christmas and, and tell you that. Uh, Thank you very much. Is she there where we can say a word to her? Yes, I care, Beth. Hello. We wanted to, Lady Bird and I wanted to tell you and the President. Uh, how loved you are and how admired you are and how grateful we are for all that you have uh, oh, uh, done for us. You're just too nice, Mr. President. No, I'm not. <laughs> too nice. No, I'm not. You always had a wonderful day with your family. We have. We're just so blessed. We had the sweetest uh, daughters here, and uh, we talked to the boys last night in Da Nang. The one of them went up and met with the, Mar the air boy, went up and met with the Marine, and uh, we talked to him about 9 o'clock. It was 9 o'clock in the morning there. Oh. And uh, we were so thrilled, and we made both of them's little baby. Uh, one of them baby's two months old, one's a little less than two years, and we made them both squeal over the telephone so they could hear them. <laughs> oh, that's great. Uh, we uh, we, we uh, think of you often, and... Uh, every time I go by your picture, uh, I see my favorite first lady except one. Oh, well, I appreciate that a lot. And the one, the one that, the, the other one is on the phone, wants to say hello to you. <laughs> oh, Miss Truman, I'm just getting all packed and ready to go, and uh, I'm, I'm just thinking in, uh, I, in all my time here, I've always uh, just considered you such a strong, good help to Lyndon, and to, and you, you've both been a, a great reliance oh, to us, so and nice to say that. we appreciate your friendship, and we're that just so us. fond of you. That gives us a big lift. Did I tell you the other day, I told you this, but I want to tell you again. The other day, my cabinet gave me a silver uh, a blotter uh, with a silver pen set on it, and they had the major acts that we had passed, uh, more than a hundred. Oh, is that true? And the, uh, you know, things like elementary education and medical care and things of that kind, civil rights and uh, uh, conservation measures, and they listed each one of the major bills, and they said that they had a nice little statement about the how, how they were glad to serve an administration past all of these. Well, that was a lovely gift. I took it and uh, reviewed it on a trip that I was making home. And you know that uh, almost half of the bills that I had passed, President Truman had started 20 years ago. Is that so? That's so, very interesting. So I thought that you would... Uh, you would uh, be interested in knowing the most of the good things like education and Medicare and civil rights, conservation. It took 20 years to get his ideas through, but so they were finally passed. And, 
I tried to say that to the country, but the papers don't pay much attention to it. Oh, no. <laughs> Well, you, you have a healthy regard, Father. <laughs> well, we'll let you go, and we hope we get to see you during the next year.